Hello everyone, this is Methlo Kaiju, and today I'm back with another video, this time a Godzilla vs. Kong news video, obviously. And today we have some possible information. And the reason why I say possible is because only one news outlet has reported on this. Supposedly it's an exclusive, and because this website or this source is, I mean, they are credible at times, but other times they can be a little bit clickbaity and all that kind of stuff. And that is comicbookmovie.com. Okay, you might have heard of them. Um, they are credible sometimes. Other times it's clickbait or just completely fabricated or they just misconstrued something or whatever. So take it as you will. I personally think it's fake because of those reasons I mentioned and because there's no evidence proving this to be true. So I think this is false, but you guys can make your own assumptions later or conclusions later but let us assume this is true okay well supposedly they were able to get an interview with Michael Doherty and they asked about the post credit scene and whether it teases Mecha King Adora in Godzilla vs Kong and if you're wondering the teaser or the end credit scene does directly affect what happens in Godzilla vs Kong for all of you people who are still thinking it has to do something with a Godzilla 3 or Godzilla 4 or something. So there's that. Anyhow, here is the supposed quote by Michael Doherty. Quote unquote, that wasn't a direct setup of Mecha King Adora. No, I'm not saying it's not, but if you think about King Adora and what he's capable of, regeneration being a key one and the ability to call on the other titans, he's a gold mine of opportunity. That DNA is an untapped resource as far as Charles Dance's character is concerned. A few scrappings of cells, and who knows what you can create with it. So there is the quote. Very, very interesting, if true. So if we're assuming this to be true, then we can safely say that Mecha King Adora is not going to be in Godzilla vs. Kong. I mean, I know he specifically said... I'm not saying it's not, but I mean, the very first sentence explicitly tells us Mecha King Adora is not in Godzilla vs. Kong. Even if this information is false, and even if we're not regarding this quote at all, I still do believe Mecha King Adora is not in Godzilla vs. Kong, because the thing with Mecha King Adora is that you need to have a Ghidorah base and then add mechanical parts here and there. With this MonsterVerse version, Basically, you have to have a King Adora, like a Mecha King Adora base, and then just add the single head on it. It just doesn't make any sense. It's literally reversed and the opposite, so it just doesn't make any sense Mecha King Adora being in Godzilla vs. Kong, or maybe even at all in the MonsterVerse ever. So, that is just my opinion. Another thing to keep in mind is the supposed quote right here also mentions about DNA and Charles Dance maybe doing something with it. And this obviously hints to us that King Adora, the King Adora DNA will be implemented into some other creatures or whatever. And it'll end up creating a hybrid Ghidorah. Whether that be like an Orochi type Ghidorah or maybe just something completely different that has no resemblance to King Adora. Or, I don't know, something like that. I think that's also very, very possible. But, I mean, if we want to speculate, I still do believe Mecha Godzilla is in Godzilla vs. Kong. And if you want to know my reasons why, then go ahead and check my video that's in the little annotation above or whatever. So, that's my opinion. I think the Ghidorah head will somehow be implemented into Mecha Godzilla. Maybe, I don't know, somehow they get the brain of the Ghidorah head and they implement it onto Mechagodzilla, maybe? I, I, I don't know, I'm still thinking how, but I, I'm still a firm believer in that claim either way. So anyhow, that is all for this video. I know, a pretty short video, but I do want to give you guys this possible information. Again, possible information. Tell me in the comments below, do you believe in this information? Do you think it's completely fake? And assuming it is true, what are your thoughts on a possible hybrid Ghidorah? And just what are your thoughts on my opinion that Mechagodzilla is in Godzilla vs. Kong? Do you think I'm completely wrong? Do you think I'm right? Tell me in the comments below. So that's all for this video. Remember, subscribe, like, and comment. This is Methylokaiju, signing out.